All right, welcome back to the stream. Welcome back to another video. Today, we're going to get into a variety of topics, but this first topic, we are going to talk about how Tesla Model 3 discounts have begun in the amount of 1500 plus. We've been talking about this is going to happen. This was going to start at a certain point, and I'm actually a little bit surprised it's already started this quickly early in the month. And of course, we'll talk about that. We're going to stream for an hour, give or take. We're going to do a variety of topics, including Tesla dropped a bunch of Model Y inventory, best resale value for the Tesla Model S and X, the Tesla used car market potentially might be rebounding, and how Tesla also produced Model Y versus Model 3, two at a two to one rate, Giga Mexico, and uh, much, much more. And of course, as a part of the live stream, we, I will answer all of your questions as you put into the chat, because that's a benefit. But before we do that, let's roll that intro real quick. All right, so thanks for watching another stream. Thanks for watching another video. My name is Dennis, and I love talking about Tesla hacking, as I like to call it, but basically just getting the best deal on a Tesla at the best possible price or just getting really good financing on your Tesla. So if you're just interested in any of that, please hit that subscribe. And today's video is actually sponsored by my Patreon link where you can get the best credit union and interest rates for your Tesla down below in the description that are all better than Tesla financing. So check it out. And shout out to my latest Patreon members, RG Bug. <laughs> Steve and Alan, thank you for joining. Thank you for supporting. And if you want to check it out, down below in the description. But thank you all for being here. Hit the like button and the comp button. So for it, thank you for all that. Uh, so let's just jump into it. So Model 3, sorry for the delay. Uh, Model 3, there was, uh, this is what we know. This is what we've looked at and the history. Tesla Model 3 standard range and long range had price discounts, price decreases, right? So if we go to our handy dandy price discount history tracker, you can see the Model 3 long range in this column right here, which you can't order, but it still exists out there. If you don't know how to buy it, I'm going to show you just in a second. It was $58,000. And then they on January 12th, when they did price drops across all models, it went from $58,000 down to $50,000. So an $8,000 discount. The Model 3 standard range, though, didn't really get that much of a discount. It went from 47 down to 44 and then down to 43.5 and then down to where it is today at $43,000. But if we look historically, that's not actually the lowest price of a Model 3 standard range that it's ever, ever been. Historically, the Model 3 standard range has actually been as low as, what, $37,000, $37,000, give or take. And it seems like now that price point, we're getting ever closer and closer. Tesla, we've talked about this, you know, Tesla works in quarterly cycles because you know that's how their report their sales reported is reported to wall street that's how i report it uh, you know basically all manufacturers kind of work in this in sense and march is the last month of the quarter it's the last uh, first month of the first quarter of the year and so we're at this point right now where Tesla might need some sales and they might need sales in the Model 3 segment. Uh, we started to see discounts across the world just a few days ago. And now it seems like uh, Tesla has put on the discount button. And what's surprising me here is that it's so early within the month. It's only March 7th. So we've got at least, what, three weeks left in the month for the end of the close. But Tesla is starting to teether out and see if they need to discount a little bit more and and this is where those discounts actually are. So if you look at waitingfortesla.com, which is a third-party aggregator site, shout out to TJ and the team. This is a third-party site that just lists all the different new Tesla vehicles that are out there across the country. And you can see right on this, you know, smack dab in the middle of your screen, 1430 discount. Here's another one, $1,100 discount, another one, $1,000 discount, and the list goes on and on and on. Here's another one, $1,400 discount. And so the cheapest one right now, I mean, this... This is not a bad deal. I mean, 1,400 miles, I mean, that's that's not a lot. I mean, it's it, it's, it can seem like a lot, I get it, but I mean, Tesla 18 inch rims like that, that should be able to last a good 30 to 40,000 miles. So you haven't really touched even a little bit of the life tread of those tires, but 1,400 miles, 
short range, standard range, the LFP battery that potentially might not get a tax credit moving forward once the IRS and Treasury make some sort of announcement. And right here, 41560, it's in Santa Barbara, California, which is not too far from LA. That's a two hour drive, give or take maybe three hours. Uh, you got to remember in California, you get the $2,000 CVR rebate, you get the $7,500 tax credit. So I don't even know what to calculate this, but this is potentially, potentially a what? A, a, a vehicle, if you factor in the $7,500 tax credit, if you factor in the $2,000 rebate, that's a purchase price of $32,000 and some change. Of course, there's destination fees, there's other fees, taxes, all on top of that, but there's your base price, your base MSRP, give or take, factoring out the federal tax credit and the CVRP at $32,000. Let me fact check my math on that, $41,000. 560 minus 7500 minus $2000 CRP. Yeah, $32,000. I mean, that that is uh that's that's decently a value right there. And let's just see. Let me I mean, California is a hot market uh, and already sold already. So, uh we we're just talking about stuff, but there's more discounts. I think on page 2 when I was taking a look, 1200, 1000, 1000, 900, 1200, 1200 and it seems like Tesla has uh, put a bunch of these out there. Right now there's, you know, a good amount at 25 yesterday where there's only 3 or 4 and now there's 25 demos actually coming into the market. And so, it, you know, this this early in the game is kind of interesting, I would say, especially it's early in March right now. So we're certainly going to start to see a lot more discounts. And so if you're on the fence right now for a Model 3 standard range, it might be the absolutely best time, especially if the IRS and the Treasury do not release any more guidelines on the federal tax credit. And would you, if you don't know what that is, uh, there is a $7,500 federal tax credit. There's a little bit more details here. And at any moment in March, the IRS and the Treasury could release more guidelines and these $7,500 could get nullified. But right now, it seems like a really good time to be able to take advantage of some of that. And also, you can use financing partners like Tenant down below in the description where you can defer $7,500 off that federal tax or get that really, really low monthly payment. Check out that Tenant link down below in the description. And that way, you can get a really a decent uh, monthly payment. Good for people that need more cash flow month in and month out. But, you know, at the end of the day, we're also still, you know, a little bit further away from Tesla's lowest, lowest, you know, price point. I'm not saying that they will go down to a $37,000 our price point, but uh, we still got some room, maybe four, five thousand, maybe just four thousand dollars. And so we've seen this in the past. Tesla will do discounts like this. They'll test the market and see if like that price point will actually sell. And they essentially did that with the Model S and the X recently. There was a ton of demo Model Xs that had 15, 16, 17,000 dollar discounts. If you don't believe me, check out the Model X videos that I did like this past week or even last week. And they dropped the price of the Model X $10,000 but the discount didn't increase. It kind of, it also reduced $10,000. And so that's why there's a ton of them right now that only have a measly two, three, four. I mean, we say measly, but uh, you know, measly to what it was at 13, 14, $15,000. But definitely some pretty interesting stuff. Here's a nice little chart from Matt Jung showing the Tesla inventory. If you follow that, you know, we, we love this chart. We shout out to Matt Jung for putting this together. You can see there's a nice healthy increase of Tesla Model 3s. Right now we're at 286 and we know exactly what happens when Tesla inventory e increases. They they, uh, they freak out a little bit and then they whack prices. That's essentially what's going on with the Model S and the X. It's, of course, not going on with the Model Y right now because Model Y is essentially sold out. But there's also some Model Y inventory as well. So definitely some pretty interesting stuff. Let me know what your thoughts on are. Uh, are do you have a pending Model 3 order? Are you considering potentially you know, switching to one of these demos if it's near you. I mean, California is a hot market. So if you're trying to get one that's in California, it's going to be really tough. But it seems like Utah, North Carolina, Arizona, Washington, all these other, you know, far away places from California that, uh, you, I mean, good for you guys, like good for whoever's out there. Can You can get a deal, that's for sure. But uh, uh, we're going to jump into our next topic. But before we do that, this video is actually sponsored by my Patreon link. Down below in the description is a Patreon link where you can support the channel. And there's a variety of benefits but some of them include actually scheduling a call with me where you can ask me any questions about buying a Tesla, selling a Tesla, even financing a Tesla. And after you join the Patreon, you get a link to my buying guide, which has links to all the resources that I use to get the best possible deal at the best price, including credit unions and interest rates on that list that all have better rates, better than Tesla financing and Tesla financing like 5.59%. So definitely check it out. Link down below in the 
description.